My name is Sarah. And yes, that's a very popular name. And I'm spoiled. You might think I am just a fancy girl. But no, that's not the case. I am the most popular girl in my school. Not for my looks. Not for my personality. But for my life. I was a loser. A geek, in fact. I always study. And it was all I could ever think about was my grades. But then, my dad became the president. That day I went back to school, everyone regretted everything they ever did to me. So nowadays, they all regret anything and everything they ever did to me. But of course, there's always a downfall. And everyone has an enemy. Mine? Well, her name is Kitty. Well, at least that's what her friends call her. And what I used to. I call her Kitty because she's soft fragile, and she can be cute at times, especially when she's trying to get out of trouble. But that's not the point. You see, we in kindergarten and grade school, we were best friends. But like I said, we all have our enemies. So, well, she found new friends, who the heck knows why, but she completely forgot about me. That day forth, I made a promise to myself that I would find better friends than her, and that I'd never hang out with any of her friends or talk to her again. From then on, I never, ever talk to her again. But I still have my new friends. And not just the people who crowd around me because I'm popular. I actually have friends. One of them is Jenna, and one of them is Sophie. They're the only people that are actually ever there for me. And they're better friends than she ever was. My dad's never home because he has to work, but that leaves me to do whatever I want. I am spoiled rotten as you expect, since my dad's rich and all. But that's not all. There are times, times when I don't even know if I can trust anyone, even my friends. And sometimes I wonder anyone actually if she actually ever cared not just about me but my feelings every so often she comes she gets me into an argument of course I get in trouble since my dad's never known I can't deal with it 
is exactly why I will get my revenge.